everyone, and welcome to my second opening of Divine Lucky Envelopes. Last year was the year of the ram, this year is the year of the monkey, and I have acquired over the past two weeks 200 Divine Lucky Envelopes and 42 Homemade Lucky Envelopes from doing dailies. Now these are actually affected by Magic Find. They're one of the few items in the game which is affected by Magic Find when you open it. So I am going to get my Magic Find as high as I can. And I have done that so far by being here in the Silver Wastes. Being in the Silver Wastes doing events will give me stacks of Perseverance, which gives me 150 Magic Find for the five stacks. Each stack gives you 30. Um, I have defeated the Vine Wrath, which gives me another 50% magic find. I have a base account magic find of a 146. Um, and I have a couple other magic find things on. Uh, my upgraded guild hall um, has given me a 10% magic find. I actually went to the guild hall, grabbed a magic find boost for 10%. I already have a celebration bonus on um, that is either a celebration booster or a birthday booster. That boosts my magic find by 100%. And I have an item booster for 50 uh, my guild is also giving me, simply by repping the Peachy Party, um, I have an additional 20%. All of those bonuses, uh, and we're not done yet, all of those bonuses are giving me, um, I have a total of 516% magic find, which is already higher than my video last year, so this, I'm excited. <laughs> we're gonna see if I'm gonna turn a profit this year, it's all RNG. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do to boost my magic find even more is go here into my, uh, the Peachy Party has a little stock of banners here, 15% magic find guild banner. So I am going to, uh, activate that. That gives me a 15% boost instead of that 10 that was on there. Um, I've got some other items in my inventory to pop here. Um, like I said, I already have a celebration booster on. Celebration and birthday boosters don't stack. It's the same kind of buff. Um, I already have that. Um, I have an old magic find booster, which I am told uh, will also increase. There you go. The old one also stacks with the new one, so that's an additional 50. I have some lucky fireworks, which will give me 10. I'm going to pop my utility buff, a sharpening stone, which gives me 30% magic find and a uh, chocolate omnum berry cream, just like last year, which will give me 40% while under the effects of a boon, which I'm always under the effects of Aegis because I'm a guardian. And we are up to a total of 651%. And now let's open up these envelopes. <sighs> Fingers crossed, Iron Jesus be kind. What are we gonna get? Let's go. So now we have to look and see if we made back our 200 gold. I got um, eight ornamental golden trophies worth 71 gold, 202 golden monkey figurines, which gets me 179 gold back. So we have already more than made our money back. We got one lucky great mon monkey lantern. Last year I didn't get any great ram lanterns, so that's awesome. Uh, let's open the 42 homemade lucky envelopes and then we'll kind of put all the profit together and, and see what we made in raw cash. All right, so those 200 envelopes as well as the smaller homemade ones, uh, this is basically what we got. We got one great luck, luck, lucky great monkey lantern, a whole slew of regular um, back pieces, the Monkey Lantern, lots and lots of uh, magic find for my account, um, a good handful of food items, um, which I could use or sell, um, a lot of fireworks that I can, again, either use and uh, or, or use for scribing, some of them are sellable, um, but the, the big money makers right here, this is what we really want, is the eight ornamental golden trophies, 203 golden monkey figurines, and 14 red festival lanterns for a little bit extra. Um, let's go sell these to a vendor and actually do the math on what I gained. So after doing the math, it looks like I made about 52 gold, and that's um, that's minus uh, selling the, the lanterns if I choose to sell the food and the fireworks. That's just raw cash from the junk items, the junk items that come out of the envelopes. I actually made a little bit more gold than last year, which I had a little bit more magic find than last year, so to me, that works out just as it should have, so... 
I'm happy. I I made about 52 gold in doing it. You know, I had to put down about 200 gold up front, but I made some back. Um, I know not uh, everybody was as lucky, but uh, it's it's fun. I love doing these lucky envelopes every year, and uh, I hope you guys enjoy watching. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys again in another Guild Wars 2 video, and again next year for more lucky envelopes. Take care, guys. Bye!